Hey guys, Geek Info everyone! On this video I'm gonna tell you how to create a directory in Linux. So after this video you're gonna know how to create a directory in Linux with different options. So let's start. So the mkdir, mkdir command, uh, short from make directory, is a command used to make a new directory. So syntax is like that, mkdir, plus you uh, have to type the name of the directory you want to create. So in my case it's gonna be directory, directory1 press enter as you can see there is a directory named directory1 created uh, to remove uh, a directory you can use a remove command short rm plus option uh, d and you have mentioned the name of the directory you want to remove so press enter as you can see there is no directory now uh, so let's check some more information about uh, this command in Kadir. You can use a help option and there is some information and description about this command plus information about options of this command. To check uh, more information about this command and you can use a man command. So press enter and you can see there is a uh, some information about this command, including descriptions, uh, options, etc. So it's pretty useful sometimes to use uh, help and man command, you know. Uh, so uh, let's talk about options. Let's see what option you can use with mkdir uh, command. You can use uh, help. Uh, so there are several options you can use. Most useful and most used options uh, is the M option and P option. Let's start with the first one, M option. So M option is about a uh, permission for the directory. Uh, let's see if I just create a directory without any option. So the name is dir1. Uh, okay, clear. Uh, so to use a uh, LC uh, command plus some options. Uh, so on the first column of this directory, you know, you can see permission. So it's a default permission for this uh, directory. You know, if we create uh, the directory by default. Okay, we can use uh, M option to just set a specific permission. By the way, uh, about uh, permission, I will create a video where I gonna tell all information about permission, what is that, how it's set. But now on this video, I'm gonna show you how to use it in the without any. Uh, like specific information about permissions, you know, in common. Okay, uh, let's use mkdir plus option m, and then you have to specify and or set the uh, permission for the directory. So it's a 444, so means a specific, you know, uh, permission, and it's gonna be dir2 the name of the directory I want to create. So press enter. Okay, as you can see, uh, uh, there is a not default permission for this directory we created, dir1. Uh, so actually it's uh, sometimes it's really uh, useful to use a command with this option. So I hope uh, you can use it, you know, in your uh, Linux activity. So, uh, but uh, let's uh, uh, go ahead. So second option, uh, as you can see, 
it's a P option. So uh, P option uh, actually it's a uh, uh, this option just create all directories leading up to the given directory that don't exist already. Uh, let's see, we have like two directories now and if we want to create uh, some directories inside this directory without like simultaneously, you know, if we try to uh, like use uh, this option p and syntax is gonna be like that uh, dear one dear uh, three dear four uh, so that what 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 will happen like when when we just uh, uh, run this command Okay, let's press enter. So, in this command, uh, all uh, directory we mention uh, will create it if they, uh, they are not exist. Uh, that means that, okay, we have like a dear one directory, of course we have. Uh, so, uh, but inside this directory dear one, so we don't have there is no any directories, you know, inside. And by this command, we create a, a directory name uh, dir3, and then we create directory4 inside the directory dir3. Let's check it. Here one. Okay, there is a, a directory name dir3, as you can see. Okay, and there is a directory uh, named dir4 on the directory dir3. Okay, let's move back. Uh, but we have another directory. Let's, let's check if we just uh, run this command, but without p option. Okay, we just... Uh, uh, run this command regarding directory 2 but without p option and what happened? Okay, I uh, cannot create the permission denied. Okay, doesn't matter. We can use uh, sudo. Okay, but still not no such file or directory, you know, there is gonna be uh, error returns, you know, uh, and just if you want to create a, a like full pass of uh, directories, you know, uh, even if uh, there is uh, some directory exists, you know, you can use uh, uh, mkdir uh, and with uh, option p command. So it's gonna be useful for sure in some scripts. Uh, so uh, so. Thank you for watching this video. I hope uh, this video like uh, provides some useful information for you. Thank you.